Hello and welcome to another Scratch tutorial. Today we're going to make a little game where a plane flies around and stuff. Exciting, right? Um, okay, so first let's draw a new sprite. Um, so in the costumes, let's zoom in. Make a bitmap because pixels are cool. Um, and then um, let's make our plane. Let's make this size. Three, five. That's the size you want. So, um, so, um, so you first we want to draw a little plane. I'm just going to draw like a triangle because awesomeness. Um, and make sure it's pointing to the right. And yeah, okay, so I want to move this to the center. So let's just center that. Maybe draw like a little window. Excuse me, sorry. It is a good window color. Okay, so now we have our little spaceship. So on, on flag, let's get one of those. Um, then we want to go to your starting position, and, um, so let's just drag him over here, because that's where we'll want to be, and then we'll tell it to go to this position, and then next, let's get a repeat forever function, we'll just start with the basic movement, um, and let's just say, um, repeat forever, um, then set x, and then we want, and then we want to set X to, or actually we don't want that. Sorry. Um, we want to set the Y. Sorry about that again. To mouse Y. So now we have our little thing. So now we want things to move past. Um, maybe first let's make a little laser to shoot. Um, so let's draw a sprite. It, this doesn't have to be anything fancy. Ah. So let's zoom in. Make it red. Convert to bitmap. Uh, I want to make this a little smaller, though. Because, I don't know. It's just my personal preference. Um, so let's draw our laser. And now, um, so let's draw our laser, and now we'll get another on flag, repeat forever. So, in this one, we'll say, if, if, um, space key pressed, um, then we're going to say, create a clone of myself, so it will make a duplicate of itself, that's under the orange blocks. Um, so then you want to get a when I start this clone block, um, and then let's go to looks. Um, so we want to put on the normal program on flag hide, then when I start as a clone show. Um, now let's go, let's get a go to, and then instead of random position, let's replace this with sprite one, which is our little plane spaceship thingy. Um, and then, uh, let's have it go back a few layers um all right let's go backwards let's just make this 200 so it's always on the back which is just i don't know convenience um so um next we want to um get a repeat until function um and then we want to get a um touching edge so it's under the if touching mouse pointer drop down menu um so if it's touching the edge um then it will um delete this clone um 
which is again under the orange blocks. Um, and then we we just want to get a block that says um, change x by 10. So now, um, so now, um, hang on, let's get rid of this. So, um, or right, space key, sorry, I was confused for a second. So now you can make little lasers. Um, and let's go ahead and change this to mouse pressed. I forgot to do that. I know there's really no excuse for that. So um, now you can shoot little lasers. Um, that's cool. If you add a delay function here, it will slow down your fire rate. That might be better for certain things. You can also have a wait until not mouse pressed. But let's just get on with it and draw a little alien guy. So um, this is the little alien guy. Um, let's put him in the center. And this one I'm just going to make a circle. And let's make a blue circle for the eyeball. And a smaller blue circle. Let's make this. Six. So now we have our little alien. Okay. So now let's let's just do this. Um, let's just send both of these programs to that sprite, and we'll modify them in there. So, um, oops, must have missed that one. So now we have this. So, no. Oh. Okay, whatever. Um, okay, sorry, that was a little confusing. So let's get rid of all of this. And delete that, okay. So, no so now um, we'll do create a clone of myself. Sorry, the people behind me just lowered my chair for a second. They're being very annoying. If you see them in the hallway, tell them not to annoy me next time. So now let's get a delay function. So let's say every five seconds it will do this. Um, so every five seconds it will create a clone of itself. Um, so now instead of going to sprite one, let's tell it to go go to um go to um this pos this position except we want to make the y random so let's go to operators um let's get a pick random um and say let's go to x 237 y pick random um negative 180 to 180 and now um this will make it show up anywhere along this area so so then it will show up it will and then we want this to be negative let's say six so it moves slower than the little lasers you're shooting um so next um so now um let's get an if statement um so uh let's actually put this on top This is okay. So, um, so now, so now, um, we want to get a if touching color. Um, so if touching color red, and we want to make this fully saturated and fully bright because that's the color of this laser. Um, so if it's touching that color, then, um, it will delete that clone. Um, so, all right, so now we have kind of a basic game. Um, we haven't added score or something yet, but, um, we have a good base game and I think that's pretty good. The only thing I would suggest is maybe adding aliens at a faster rate. Like, let's just see what it does. Yay!